Hello everyone, Sigmalator here, and welcome to GTA 3 The Definitive Edition. Let's get right into this, shall we? Oh, the frames! I'd say it's it looks good. Liberty City is in shock today as the police and emergency services deal with the aftermath of a devastating attack on a police convoy this morning. As yet, no details have been released about the prisoners being transferred in the convoy, and no group has claimed responsibility. The convoy left police headquarters early this morning for a routine transfer of felons to Liberty Penitentiary. The attack took place on the Callahan Bridge, leaving few witnesses and the bridge itself severely damaged. Some of the convicts are thought to have perished in the explosion that followed the initial attack. Revelations as to the professionalism of the attack struck police hours afterward, when identification of the missing felons were further hampered by an attack by computer hackers on police headquarters databases. With the Porter Tunnel Project falling behind schedule, this disaster leaves Portland isolated from the rest of the city. I believe you. Aye, aye, get lost. Really? That's all that took? God, these cops are weak. Well, that's that buggered. And so begins. I know a place on the edge of the red light district where we can lay low, but my hands are all messed up. So you better drive, brother. On it. Oh god. Alright, need to relearn the, these controls. Oops. Ah, there's the handbrake, R1. Here we are. This is the place right here. Let's get off the street and find a change of clothes. On it. We're on a mission. You can save your game here. This will advance time by six hours. And that's where we can store our vehicles. Nice. I know this guy. He's connected. His name's Luigi. Me and him go back so I can probably get you some work. Come on, let's head over. Alright, that's how you cycle weapons. Good. Love. You're listening to a Love Media Station. Enjoy. Alright, we're back here on Chatterbox, the radio show that never gets old. I'm Laszlo with open ears and a closed mind. Hello. <laughs> hey, Laszlo. I wanted to talk about spanking. Oh, God, not another one. This is Luigi's Club. Let's go around the back and use the service door. Luigi. How are you? It has been many years since we last saw each other.
Wait here, man, while I go in and talk to Luigi. got some business upstairs or maybe you could do me a favor one of my girls needs a ride so grab a car and pick up misty from the clinic then bring her back here remember no one messes with my girls so keep your hands on the wheel if you don't mess this up maybe there'll be more work for you now get out of here pretty sure in the original he said keep your hands on, on the wheel and off misty That up. I mean, you can't just drive round. Talking about this, I mean, killer bees swarming. It sounds pretty serious. Ah, but the killer bees are nothing compared to ants. You can't kill them. They're like sheep. They're going to take over. All right, thanks, caller. Ants, killer bees, bad people. What's plaguing you? Call now. Chat about. <laughs> uh, yes. I'd like to say something about these damn people on trains and buses in the city who yammer on and on into their cell phones. I'm really glad we get to hear about what you're having for dinner. What we oh. should do hey, is take them up and put them on an island. I am the president of a group called I am Misty. I Misty. Your organization's called crap. What, what kind of moron are you? You, you want to round people up for using a phone? But you're, you're calling up on a phone to, to tell the world about it. I mean, how many people are there in this crap? Citizens are raging against phones, Laszlo. How many people? There are three of us. It's hard organizing meetings without the There we go. Hey, fifty hundred dollars just for picking up a girl and bringing her back. I'll take it. First day on the job. Nice. Right, first thing I'm going to do is go and get my favourite car in the game. If I can remember where it is. Is your job affecting your health? Yes, here we are. Does working take Is it here yet, yet though? Events like watching wrestling. There's an easy solution. Sue your boss. See the Yes, it the is. You can sue anyone for pretty much anything and you'll probably win or at least get a sub. The Banshee. Damage award from your employer. We also specialize in awards for injuries. I love this car. Drain accidents. Shut up. Oh, the driving's a bit. Hello, caller. You're on Chatterbox. Laszlo, I just wanted to make your viewers aware that. Okay, now this is a radio show. There we go. We have viewers. We have listeners. Uh, okay. Anyway, Laszlo, I just wanted to make your viewers aware the first international puppetry <laughs> festival is next month at the fairgrounds, bro. If you're interested in becoming a puppet master or a ventriloquist, you should. Yeah. This is mine forever now, and I probably won't even drive it again. There we go. And we have a safe point. Alright, R2 to swing the bat. Okay. R1 to cycle weapons. Circle to punch. Alright. Where's Sprint? Can I not Sprint? Alright, doesn't look like it. It is definitely looking a lot better than it did back on the PlayStation 2. I'm not expecting a huge improvement because uh, well, it's only a remaster, not a remake. What was that? Oh, deliveries. Don't spank my bitch up. Luigi said to, to give you this, so here, here, take it. This is new high on the street. 
goes by the name of Spank. Some wise guy's been introducing this trash to my girls down Portland Harbor. Go and introduce a bat to his face. Then take his car, respray it. I want compensation for this insult. Got it. I mean, I've already got a bat, but I'll take it. Hey there, excuse me. Yum yum. By genuine reproduction medieval artifacts, including maces, double handed battle swords, and one size fits all chain mail. And this weekend only, excuse me. Authentic mechanical lady of the lake in Excalibur. It's perfect for your garden pond or swimming pool. And learn how to rid your condo of vermin using a penny whistle and a mysterious prancing German named Hans. The medieval millennium fair every weekend at Liberty City Park. All right, Liberty City, you are listening to Chatterbox, the show that is the number one reason for the success. I'm just trying to get to my job, people. Well, that was quick. Opinions on Chatterbox, which is a uh, Liberty City's premier television station. But why don't you like clothes? I just hate no. so constricting. I mean, there's a line where clothes, and the line is the king of the jungle. So why can't I, a humble citizen, go naked? Well, I mean, I guess a line has two distinct advantages over you. One, uh, it's as you say, a king, uh, uh, one. Uh, uh, one for the handbrake. Two, it's a cat, and therefore it doesn't have to. And three, Sorry, Luigi, I uh, dented your car slightly. Oh, God, what is it? What is happening? Oh God, what's the controller's vibrating like crazy? What's happened? Uh, usually a thousand dollars to respray. This time it's free. New engine, paint job, the cops won't recognize you. I'm naked and I feel so good. Well, what about winter? What do you mean? You know, I mean, what about right, and I'll take it to Luigi's lockup. Seems easy enough. Do you prance about like a ninny waiting for your privates to go blue? I was born naked and I'm gonna die naked. <laughs> it all shriveled up by the sound of things. Winter was invented by clothing companies. Clothes of course it was. I love Chatterbox. People waiting to talk about real things here. Nudity is real. Open your eyes. Take off your pants. Come on. Come on, Laszlo. You can be a figurehead for Liberty City News. All right, Fruit Loop. You enjoy your nakedness. Hey, four grand. Thank you. Hey, officer. I'm not going to steal a car just yet. Okay, yeah, I definitely can't sprint. I'm pretty sure you could sprint before. Oh, yeah, there we go. I still have to, like, really ham the uh, X button. Ah, I remember. Those packages you have to pick up. What's that? Thanks for the free gun. Was that a rampage? No. Oh, I think there was a way you could get up to the roof. Okay. Why is the controller rumbling? There must be something around here I can do. Ah, here we go. There's a rampage there. So There's got to be something up on the roof, maybe. Ah, there's one of those packages. In package, one out of a hundred. Fair enough. Murder 30 Diablos in uh, 120 seconds.
Oh, there goes his head. Oh shit, he's dropped a load of money. A minute left and 18 to go. I think I'm going to fail this one. Three left, come on. Hey, there we go. There was some health around here somewhere, I think. There we go. All right, excellent. A whole bunch of cash. And the great thing about the rampages, there are no repercussions. Oh, well, that was that was quick. All right. What's what's Luigi got for us next? Drive Misty for me. What am I gonna do, please? Hey, I gotta talk to you. All right, Mick, I'll talk to you later. How you doing, kid? The Don's son, Joey Leon, he wants some action from his regular girl, Misty. Go pick her up at Hepburn Heights, but watch yourself. That's Diablo turf. Then run her over to his garage and threaten and make it quick. Joey ain't the kind you keep waiting. Remember, this is your foot in the door. So keep your eyes on the road and off Misty. Okay, that's where he says it. Okay. I thought the line had been cut for some reason. It was just in the... I just remember it being in the, a different place, that's all. Fair enough. Alright. Let's grab a car. Alright. Oh, is it down here? Why'd you jump in front of me, idiot? Come on, Missy. Alright, so s square and circle to look left and right now for some reason. Oh, for goodness sake. Sorry, Misty, that was not my intention. Jesus. I'll just leave them to it. I'm on my I'm on a mission of my own. Sorry, guys. Something I own. Exploit me. 
you exploit something you own. You don't own your children, you weirdo. God damn. People in Liberty City are fucked. I'll be with you in a minute, spark plug. Hey, I'm Joey. Luigi said you were reliable, so come back later. There might be some work for you. All right? Nice. All right. I think that that would do for now. Let's go. Jesus. Yeah. This is definitely more of a remaster than anything else because uh, the handling of the vehicles is still a tad ropey. It can cross rivers. So far, I've only hit a few puddles, but it's good to know it's there. With the time, the strip mall parking lot, I can focus on the important things, like gazing longingly at the. He was like that when I got here. That's a triad. Don't really want to be messing with them too much. All right, here we go. All right, I think that will do for the first episode of GTA 3 Definitive Edition. What do you guys think so far? For me, it yeah, it looks a lot better. It handles a lot better as well, but it's still undeniably GTA 3. Jank and Hall. But for now, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later, this has been GTA 3 Definitive Edition, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.